Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Okay, <coughs> now this is uh, another tutorial on Total Simulator. And uh, in this tutorial, <coughs> I will be showing you guys about something that might be you, you have done before, but uh, some of you guys maybe are not familiar with this type of uh, modular uh, simulation of Proteus software. As we are all aware about Arduino controllers and Arduino modules, there are many different types of Arduino uh, boards available in the market. So, in, uh, but we know, but we might don't know that uh, this Arduino board can be imported into our Proteus simulator. This is a very great and unique feature of Proteus because uh, this will help us to simulate our Arduino board which we want. Like uh, this is the Arduino library I am installed in Proteus and there are three I have three types of uh, Arduino board Arduino UNO, Arduino Mini and Arduino Mega 2560. Arduino Mini is Something is something like this, and Arduino Mega is this. So I will be going to use this Arduino Mega 2560 board, and will show you a very basic blink uh, sketch of Arduino, and we will try to simulate an LED blinking on Arduino Mega 2560 using Proteus Simulator. So let's start. Arduino IDE <laughs> First of all you need you need to install the uh, Arduino Integrated Development Environment that is Arduino IDE <laughs> Right Now Let's uh, open an example sketch that is a blink Go into the basics and click on blink It will open another sketch with this blink code this is the Arduino building code that is going to blink the LED on digital pin number 13 of Arduino UNO or Arduino Mega or Arduino Zero. So I am using Arduino Mega so uh, on digital pin 13 uh, we will see that LED will be blinking and this is the time that is one uh, second time delay for Arduino LED to blink that is one second for on and one second for off so let's see what happens uh, just a very quick review of the code the code is segregated into two parts that is setup and do this setup is just uh, here to identify to make the LED built-in built-in LED of the Arduino which is at digital pin 13 as output we need to define the code to be output okay with this function pin mode and with the function of digital write we will simply write high and low on particular uh, digital pin so this is it at a delay of one second this is thousand millisecond okay so let's see Let's compile. Here is the compile button, uh, or we can say it is a verify button. No board selected, right? Now we will, we would uh, need to select the board. Select board, and right here Mega, and we would select Arduino Mega. Click OK, and let's compile. Then compiling. Okay, now guys, you guys might have come and encounter the problem of finding the hex file of uh, this INO Arduino sketch. So this is very easy. Just go and copy this, copy this link here. In the output uh, window, the compiler shows you the path 
the path where the hex file is residing just copy this path sorry just copy this path and paste it here and now remove these double slashes because we need only single slash so here are very different files many different files and here is the file so this hex file we will simply copy this and paste it in my in my youtube channels which i have made for the paste here in place and this is the file so now in our proteus we have already inserted our module and double click on the module load the file and that is it simple and now put the LED put the LED on pin number 13 as we as we saw that it is connected to pin number digital pin number 13 so we would see the LED blinking okay so this is a very basic uh, code for LED blink on Arduino 2560 using Proteus Simulator. Okay guys, so this is it. Thank you for watching my video uh, and I hope you like it. And please do subscribe to my channel and do, do give thumbs up on my videos so that other people can uh, benefit from it. Thank you.